Since their conception more than 80 years ago as a cheap, reliable mode of transport, the scooter has enjoyed its fair share of resurgence. Owners, young and old, have taken these two wheels to their hearts. Generations of scooterists view their machines with pride and affection. We're Bristol, Bristol Mods Scooter Club. We've been formed for 20 years now. Um, the bike itself is an SX200 with a 225 engine in it. I got all the chroming done in s and in Yate in Bristol. Um, I've owned the bike seven years. Uh, basically, it's never broke down yet, thank God. Not like most of them, I always see. Um, we're all Bristol mods here. Uh, there's about 10 bikes here at the moment. There's more coming tomorrow and they're all basically done as a, as a mod bike. But I think we've gone over the top a bit more than the 60s, because we couldn't afford to have all this done in the 60s, it would have cost a bloody fortune. From Cheltenham, we're the Cheltenham Blue Diamond Scoot Club, as you can see. Um, custom, it's been done by Born To Be Wilds, Reborn To Be Wild, sorry, based in Cheltenham. The whole bike may be around seven, seven and a half thousand pounds complete, about that, and it's took about two years to complete. Just finished Wednesday night at 10 o'clock to get on the ferry for Thursday. <laughs> They walk up on a white music tent.